Good afternoon, super cool party people, and welcome to Friday. Oh, the internet just went down. That is great. Anyways, I am here. I am at my sewing machine. I'm working on masks. I just finished top stitching those ones. I have four more to go, and then gotta seal them up and blah, 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 blah. But I'm just feeling completely unmotivated to do anything today. I'm not feeling the greatest. I didn't sleep well. I woke up at like five because I couldn't breathe because of allergies. It's great. So anyways, I have just been chilling. I think I finally woke up at like 1040 and I like very much dragged my feet. Finally got out of bed, finally cooked myself some lunch, got kind of ready and like uh, I gotta deal with that. And now I've just been sat at my sewing machine uh, for the last little while. Hopefully I can just power through these. I will see how the day goes. We're supposed to go out and get some groceries later. But honestly, the way I'm feeling right now, I just don't want, I just want to go back to sleep. So we will see. But anyways, that's where we're at. I'm going uh, to go get back into this. Um, but I just wanted to start the vlog finally because otherwise I ain't going to start the vlog. Um, I feel like I have a massive amount of stuff to do on my list. So I'm just going to ignore it for a while and just work on these masks because they are on the list as well. So good. Good morning, super cool party people. Vlogging went great yesterday, as you can see. It is currently a Saturday morning. It is quarter to 11. I woke up probably 25 minutes ago. Um, yesterday, I just like, it was not a good day for me. It was so warm in my room and the smoke was like so bad. I tried, I kept my window open as long as I could and then I was like dying. Um, and then I kept it open last night too and when I woke up, it's the smoke is so much worse, so. Yay! But yesterday, we had to go to the store to go grocery shopping and when we were leaving, there was somebody calling this dog. They were like, Maya, Maya, Maya. And I was like, oh, this must be their dog. And then I realized it wasn't their dog. They had just managed to read the name off the collar. Well, this dog decided she loved me, which was like the greatest thing ever. Um, so she just like came and she would like stand by me and lean against me and sit at my feet. And anytime I walked away, she would come and do the same. And I was like, oh my God, I've been blessed. This is my dog. Um, I did not think, I wish. Um, <laughs> and then like we were loading groceries into the back of our vehicle, which has like one of those up gates. And she just like jumped over the pile of junk in the pack and into the back seat. And I was like, uh, the other, we tried calling the phone number, but it went, like, almost immediately to voicemail. And the other people were going to take her, like, they had another dog too, but Maya did not like their dog and was growling, and she just kept being by me, and I was like, I guess this is our responsibility. I, like, opened the car door, and she just got right in. I'm like, okay. So we're like, I guess we'll bring her home for now um, until these people contact us. And then I Googled the phone number on her tag, and I'm like, crap, this is for like a small community that's like 45 minutes away and it's a landline so they won't even know that we have their dog until they come until they get home after they probably search in town forever so I was like okay let's go back because it was superstore parking lot I'm like let's go back and let's do a call over the PA system and maybe the owner will be in the store still hopefully and we were coming back and I had seen a van that had like the back gate up. I'm like, oh, that kind of seems like that might be the type of vehicle <laughs> this dog came out of. I don't know. I just like felt it. And anyway, so my mom went inside and she went to get them to do a PA call. And I just hung out with Maya, who I mean, is just the sweetest. I'll show you a picture. She is so cute and honestly, like so sweet and so loving. And just look at that face. Look at that face. Anyways. We had a good time. Uh, the owner came up like almost immediately and so my mom brought her out and we reunited them. So that was great. So I had a dog for half an hour. <laughs> she was so sweet. Anyways, then came home and I don't even know what I did. I finished a bunch of masks. They're up there. One of them I think has already gone to its home because I gave it to my mom because she commissioned one for a friend and then I have to mail some and then the other ones are mo mostly for coworkers, I think. Yeah, so anyways, I'll get those sorted. And then I <laughs> I had a busy day. Even though I like did not vlog, I had a busy day. I started to make these cotton pads. So instead of like getting the, the round cotton disposable pads, I decided to make these reusable ones. So it's terry cloth on one side. And oh my God, it's so cute on the other side. Baby Yoda. Anyways, so 
as you can see, I cut out all my terry cloth. Um, so at the end of the day, I will have enough to make 20 sets of six and one extra. So I guess that'll be mine. I made actually two other ones. One, because the terry cloth has two different sides. So there's like the softer side and then there's like the scrubby side. And so I want to try one with the uh, softer side and I prefer the scrubby side because I do have I have some of these that I bought forever ago and I kept trying to buy from the same shop and every time I've tried to buy from the shop the shop has been closed so I'm like I guess I'll have to make my own and I don't know why it took me so long to realize that anyways so I'm gonna cut a bunch of different fabric with patterns today which will be nice because oh my goodness this terry cloth is so fluffy. I was just covered. It looked like I'd been snowed on yesterday. So I'm going to make some of those today. And then what else happened? I think that's about it. Yeah, so I feel, I, I feel accomplished. Anyways, I'm going to get dressed and then make food or make food and then get dressed. I don't know. Food needs to happen because I'm hungry. <laughs> And I'm going to be stuck at home all day. I was supposed to go for a walk with my friend. Because um, he just got out of the hospital. He's okay. Um, <laughs> but I can't go outside because of the smoke. So I'll have to text him and let him know. Anyways. Yeah. The plan today is going to be these. I think. And then I do have one other mask that I have been commissioned to make. So I'm just going to. I don't need to have it done until Tuesday. And um, I might make myself some more masks. I know I keep saying that. But I might actually make them. And then I would also like to. Maybe I won't do all of these today because that would be crazy, but I want to cut the Halloween scrunchies today. Like, that's the plan. Anyways, I've rambled forever. I'm going to go. I will check in with you later. <laughs> I really need to change out of my pajamas because the situation is just not working for me. Anyways, it is currently 20 after 2. <laughs> I ate lunch around like... 11:30, I think and since then I've just been at my desk cutting squares so I've got this giant pack here um, I was gonna do packs of six but then I realized that packs of seven makes more sense one for every day of the week kind of thing so I have a stack here I think I can get um, 17 I think is what it is and then I just have some extra squares so I don't know maybe I don't know what I'll do with those <laughs> then we got a bit of a mess over here which is as to be expected um, but I picked out like some really cute ones like I've got I use this one because I have a ton of it um, but I love this constellation I also have two meters of that and then I did this avocado one because I just thought that was adorable. I've got two meters of the EV, so I figured I'd go with that. This is my second pattern of Wonder Woman, so why not? And oh my god, look how adorable these Avengers are. <gasps> and then I got this fabric for scrunchies initially, but I think it's much cuter here. And then I just had some leftover, oh my goodness, of these dragonflies. So there's my options, and I've got most of my terry cloth in this bin right here there's just a couple here that wouldn't fit in <laughs> but yeah so lots of progress the next crafty step is going to be to cut all my halloween fabric into scrunchies i think um but i think first what i need to do ugh, hair there's hair everywhere is at least put away all this fabric <laughs> um and get it off my bed and probably make my bed and maybe fold my clothes, put away my sewing machine because it's just kind of in the middle of the room. It's just like right there, just, just taking up space. Um, and normally it goes in my toy box, which is right there. So I figure if I do all those things and organize a bit, then I'll feel like in much better shape. I had to open my window because with the window open, it's like 26 and a half degrees in here. Uh, but my breathing is questionable. I think this, the haze has cleared out a bit. Um, I was supposed to go for a walk with my friend today, like I mentioned, but he had to go pick up some pills at a pharmacy or something. So we're going to try for tomorrow, depending on how he's feeling and air quality. So that's the update. I know, like, I'm terrible, but it is what it is. <laughs> so yeah, I think I'm just going to do a bunch of tidying and um, we'll go from there and then at some point this weekend, I need to cut and make at least one mask, but I think I'll use that opportunity to make me a bunch of masks as well. Well, 
Well, my battery died while I was cutting scrunchies, but basically I just cut scrunchies for a couple hours. I swear all I've done today is cut fabric, legitimately. Also, I'm pretty sure like there's just so much thread and terry cloth fluff and all that on the floor here, like. <laughs> but wait, there's more. Um, it's bad, I need to vacuum. I know I need to vacuum, but. This is, you know, let me turn on a light because that's bad. I mean, lighting's not much better, but I've got these bats and I was gonna cut them all into scrunchies, but then I was like, these would be really cute for um, those cotton pads I'm making. This I just had extra. Um, same with that, because I already have scrunchies in this. I'm gonna have to see how many I have though. Um, so I've got that, I've got these pumpkins, I've got those pumpkins, I've got this candy, and, I th and then I have the rest of this fabric because I already made some masks and scrunchies out of that. So that's cool. And then I just have this fabric left to cut. I think I'll probably do the same, like half scrunchies and then half cotton pads, maybe. Closed situation, still situation. And then underneath all these scraps, <laughs> I need to cut some scrunchies of this for um, Jessica. Uh, I was thinking about making something out of this, scrunchies, I don't know. I was thinking about making a mask out of this for me, and then I have to make a mask out of that for somebody. This is just in here because it's Christmas. I have to make scrunchies out of that for Jessica or her daughter, I'm not sure which. And then same with this Cruel and Beautiful. Yeah, so. The pile's going down slowly. And honestly, I really, oh, I'm like, from leaning over that way, my face is so red. Um, honestly, I really am loving doing this and like, I'm loath to stop sewing and do the catching up on the vlogs. It's really not even, I'm pretty sure I have until the 24th edit it. Do I have it written down? I'm pretty sure I have until the 24th edit it. Maybe it's the 14th. In any case, no, no, it, I'm, it is the 24th because I didn't edit the 25th because it was day up. So I have until the 24th of September edited. It. It's just a matter of getting that intro done. I'm really hating past me right now for the whole new intro every month thing. So I just need to whip that off. And like, honestly, I need to whip that off and then I need to make one for October. <sighs> Once we do that, we're good. I also, either today or tomorrow, have to get some mail ready to send out. Oh, there's so much fluff on this lens. One second. Better. Um, anyways, at some point today or tomorrow, I have to get some mail ready. I also have to get a scrunchie ready for to go with two of the masks that I sold because pickup is happening tomorrow. So I got a lot of stuff to do, but I'm sure we'll get there. So that, that's where we're at. It's fine. Alrighty, so it is 20 after 9 now, and I finished cutting the purple and polka dot scrunchies. I think that was the last thing I needed to cut. They're over there, chilling. And then we had dinner, and then I came up, and I was like, okay, I, I have one mask that I am commissioned to make, so I'll cut that, and I want to make a couple more for me. And then um, I was I picked out, like, four patterns for me, and then the way the fabric was folded, I was like, well, I can get one more lining, so... I'm doing five masks for myself, so that means I have, I'll have eight of my really good ones that I really like. So I think that'll be good for now. I struggled to find fabric that I really, really wanted, but I'll show you my selections. So this one here is the one that someone's getting me to make, um, just fun stars. I'm gonna use the rest of that fabric. I think I'll make some scrunchies and then those cotton squares. <laughs> and then I did this one, it's black with uh, Mickey on it, which I thought was super adorable. Next is this like 8-bit Pokemon one, which I just thought would be fun. <laughs> I made a yoga, yoga, Yoda mask for somebody else and now I want one for me. It's just, it's so cute, it's just so cute. <laughs> and then I went with some more grown-up patterns. So this one's fishies. Is our fish really grown up? I don't know, it's cute though. And then I really just love this um, floral one here. If I can get it open, hello. Look how pretty that is. I definitely don't have 
uh, thread to match this. I'll have to get some thread to match that for sure, if not a couple of the other ones. But yeah, there's my new masks that I will soon be making. And by soon, I think tomorrow, Monday at the latest, Ugh, hair in my mouth. So, <laughs> still hair in my mouth. <laughs> so that's the problem with having the fans going all the time. All right, so. This is technically my list from yesterday, but I just added stuff on and just continued it today. So I have cut masks. There it is. I was like, did I not have this on my list? Okay, I've cut masks. So the things that are still on the list to hopefully complete today are putting my clothes away. Be a good thing to do. It probably won't happen. Uh, packing up some mail. Mm, probably won't happen. Also doesn't have to happen till Monday. Uh, showering desperately needs to happen. <laughs> it should have happened last night. Doing my September intro and then exporting the vlogs that I have already edited with that intro. And then um, I need to send somebody a message and that's it. So, you know, we're coming along. I don't think everything will get done, but if I can get that September intro done, like I will be jazzed. And it's just me being lazy and not wanting to do it. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to finish watching this episode of Elementary there's like 12 minutes left, so that's not too long. Um, and while I do that, I'll like tidy up some of my fabric and everything. A clean, a clean place is a good place. <laughs> and then um, I will edit my September intro after that. Hopefully quickly. My August one was super fast, which I'm glad that I didn't put a lot of effort into it because I only used it for one video. But yeah, here's hoping the September one will not take too long to do. Cute classic, it's been a while. <laughs> Anyways, I'm not naked, I promise. I mean, I'm close to naked because I'm just in a towel, but I just got a shower. It is one o'clock in the morning, but I was like, you know what? You need to shower, just get in the goddamn shower and have a shower, so I did. I have had a relatively productive time since we last talked. I exported, or I edited the September intro. It's not my best work, <laughs> but it's done. <laughs> and I export it one vlog and that is up and ready to go up tomorrow, which is exciting considering, well, I mean, technically today's, considering it's the 4th and that vlog is from like the 5th and 6th of September, it's fine though. And then I worked on these guys, more of those cotton pads uh, that I cut out last night and today. I just need to top stitch them all the way around. So that is exciting. I have 14 there. Um, cause I think I'll sell them in like packs of seven. I think I was mentioning it earlier. It makes sense. One for every day of the week. Um, and I also got put together these two masks and a scrunchie that, um, I sold and pick up is happening tomorrow. So that is exciting. So yeah, lots is happening and I put away all my clothes except for the ones that have to hang because I hate hanging clothes. I hate putting clothes away in general, but I especially hate hanging clothes. I don't know what it is, but Anyways, I'll, I'll do laundry and fold clothes any day, but hanging them up slash putting them away, just not for me. Anyways, it's fine. <laughs> I'm gonna go to sleep here soon once I like dry off a bit, because obviously I'm soaking wet at the moment. Um, and then I wrote my list for tomorrow, which includes things such as, I thought I had edited up till the 24th, but I hadn't. I just have moved the footage up to the 24th. I've only edited it up to the 14th, which still is like halfway through the month. I need to do a voiceover for September 14th for something that I don't remember what it was about anymore because it's been so long, so I might just cut that entire section. We'll see. Um, and then I want to pack up the mail and stuff tomorrow and sew more cotton pads. I'm so excited to sew. I think I showed it earlier, this pattern. It was so cute. <laughs> Anyways. Um, yeah, set up my agenda, all that fun stuff, but that is for tomorrow. I'm going to try to set an alarm, I think, so I don't get up, like, super late, because who knows? Who knows? Anyways, with that, I'm just gonna end the vlog here, and, um, I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> Good night.